Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more Solaris Showdown in MechWarrior 5, the latest DLC from MechWarrior 5 and we have a lovely new Loader King that we got for the last mission. We've, you know, toyed with it and played with it. Now it's time to put it on the battlefield and see how well it does. Let me just see... If there's anything here I want before we leave. I've got 10 million seabulls. Oh, a PPC. Ooh. Let's take one of those. I like them. I want a tier 5 one. I don't know if I have Artemis. I don't think we really want all of that or any of that. Medium claw. I'll buy it. I'll probably never use it. Arena supercharger. AMS ammo. I think I've got an AMS somewhere. Well, a couple of bins of half ammo. Let's see if there's anything else here. LBX ammo, light rifle ammo, medium chem laser. Narc SRM Ultra 5. Let's buy all of that. But otherwise, I think it is time I to... I will be waiting in the ready room, Commander. Yo, we're gonna pick up. In my sights, I'll take pick up another pilot because payday? it's good to have more. Right, let's depart. And 162 days. Where are where is Galatea? I can't tell you because I don't know because I can't click on the star map because we're in the middle of the campaign. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you do, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I will see what we are doing. 162 days. It's fine yeah i'm not gonna read through this because we will get uh, a video packet for this in a second most likely so let's set course and let's have fun listening to duncan fisher again oh nothing here fine mission briefing are we... Everything is ready. Good. Because we had such a long journey. Let's check the equipment. Oh, is that a rare thing? It is. There is a rare PPCX. Tier 4. Yoink. I don't care that it's a little bit more expensive than normal. It's good to get it. It's a binary laser. So 9 tons, 18 damage. Rate of fire of 7.3 rounds per minute and 13.3 heat. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe we'll pick that up at some point. Uh, more arena superchargers. I don't know the difference between an arena supercharger and a regular supercharger, but I haven't seen a regular supercharger in this playthrough yet. There's literally all the ammo type that you could ever want. I think we're good. Grasshopper, Orion, Quick Draw, Rifleman. No new mechs. No decent pilots. Fine. Let's go to the mission briefing. And yeah, let's let's listen to this. Only see the buzz is about to go off. The Solaris qualifying tournament is primed and ready to kick off. Let's see. Ooh, we get some salvage. Nearly five million sea bills. Nice. Weather conditions in the area will restrict visibility and have an effect on your sensors. And can I swap this for this? And can I do it before the mission? Eight days. Let's do it. So we get a tier four PPCX. Uh, oh, okay. We got. Oh, I didn't. Okay, because I jumped out, I guess they didn't reset, or they did reset. It's time to party. Here we go. The qualifying tournament on Hardcore running? is about to kick off. The opening phase Warhammer. is a 2v2 gauntlet followed by a team free-for-all match. The final team standing will punch their ticket to the FedCom Unification Tournament on Solaris. 
Running the gauntlet, we have Jake Mason and Duncan, the disappointing Fisher. Yeah. She uh, got it in for you. A uh, romantic detour gone awry. Mason and Fisher face a tough test right out of the gate. The Teal Twins have been taking the Magistracy of Konopis by storm with their winning ways. They've really been on a tear this recent circuit. Last time I brought double trouble like this, I had blurred vision thanks to a bottle of actin gin, coupled with a weekend of self-loathing. Go out the way, out the way. This could prove to be a huge turning point here. Their weapon systems just suffered a huge blow. One down. One of the twins has been knocked out of the match. I cannot believe what I am witnessing here. Believe it, baby. Headshot, lovely. Oh my god, the Teal Twins are eliminated in stunning fashion. A twin killing. Somehow, Duncan Fisher's team has made it through the first round. <laughs> I'm shocked, because Duncan never rises to the occasion. Oh, damn. Sounds like you really got on her bad side. Uh, she had the misfortune of meeting my intoxicated alter ego, Drunken Fisher. She wasn't a fan. Nice. Drunken Fisher doesn't sound like a, a good time. Right, speaking of good times, I'm hoping there's a good pair bay. Because my mech is not looking so healthy. Ooh, there is a repair bay. I actually didn't know that was there, but I'm glad that it is. Let's slowly trudge our way to the repair bay. And our measly 48 APH. It's hard to maintain intensity over the course of an entire match. These mech warriors are feeling the effects. Yeah. Um, partly because I'm slow. Uh, don't give me time. Give me time and I'll get into the fight again. No. Got eyes on the repair bay. Gonna patch myself up. Yeah, and I don't think it took any real damage, because I'm pretty sure I took all of it in that one. My cockpit is not fully here. That could be bad. How are you doing? Round two is about to commence. Yeah, you're about Standing you're a bit broken. Way is the Invictus stable, and they've lived up to their name. Losing a match is a rarity for these mech warriors. Jake Mason and Duncan Fisher are going to be in some serious trouble here. Trouble and I are well acquainted. It strikes about as much fear in me as a plumber facing down a black toilet. I'm having second thoughts about accepting this offer, Commander. Ugh, already on my third. Right, so apparently no one thinks I can win. There's Vulcan. Vulcan. Hey, Time will tell, but this could be a huge momentum swing. Nice Duncan. kill. Down, one to go. Less counting, more shooting. <laughs> he did well there. I mean, I opened him up. Big shot landed. That is a victor. Oh, team Invictus is yep. being dispatched. A heavy favorite now history. Yep, I hope there's another repair bay. Another opponent falls to my auto cannon. An incredible personality. I wonder, can I? I can't Update switch to Duncan now. Uh, you're a horrible shot. There isn't a right way to take that. Okay, yeah, another repair bay, and that's good. You know. Gotta keep my mech fresh for appearances for the fans. Have you got some wins under your belt? <laughs> Does a winning personality count? No. I think you've got your work cut out for you, Commander. No shit. System offline. We got this. Duncan Fish are doing okay.
continues. Somehow, Jake Mason and Duncan Fisher are still standing, yeah, defying still standing. all logic and reason. Sometimes there's something that's gonna pop up up there. Defying logic and reason is kind of my thing. But the path to victory is about to get even harder. Stepping into the arena is the forgotten foes. And they're gonna make Duncan Fisher remember all Grand the Dragon in his previous matches. And he got box standard PPC. Alright, let's make it out of here first, and then worry about your broken heart. Their weapons just took a hit. Let's see if that shifts the momentum here. Down there's the other Cyclops. He just took a vicious hit. Yep, don't do that. It's a silly thing to do. They are gunning for their the thingy now. Duncan Fisher. Their firepower. This could be a huge opening. I kind of wish I had SRM on here rather than LRM5, but so be it. The Forgotten Foes will never forget this loss, or who defeated them. They strutted in here like they had the match in the bag, but we proved too much. They could not overcome our mech dueling prowess. <laughs> hey, Duncan, are you calling the match or is Ava? Why? You think I have a future in it? Uh, maybe after I hang up my neural helmet for the last time. Buddy, you won't have a future at all if you don't shut up and fight. Well, it looks like we're going into the final rounds. And yeah. We've reached the final Might round of the repair. gauntlet. The married mech warriors, the Golbaras. Sounds like a very violent form of marriage therapy. This duo has a history of savage matches. They've been known to employ some very dirty tactics that have crippled their opponents. Mm. I'll take option B, where that doesn't happen. C. This match is dragging. Looks like these pilots are maxed out. Who's got the will to survive here? This is only round four, I thought it was round five. Or dual five, whatever. Annihilator 1X. They connect with a massive blow. This could really shift the momentum. Oh wow, yep. that's one gold bar down. Well, looks like flank. we've really split them up. Till death do us part, my ass. Yeah, because that cockpit is gone. That had to hurt. Don't know how they're still standing after that one. Cockpit again. What a turn of events. Got it. The gold bars are no longer standing. Well, I hope they weren't married to winning. Ooh, it's not an arm. The gauntlet match has come to a stunning end, and somehow Jake Mason and Duncan Fisher have emerged victorious. In yeah. just a moment, they'll compete for a team free-for-all match. Another chapter in the Ballad of Duncan Fisher is in the books. We got through that, but don't get cocky. Still a lot of work to do. Oh yeah, there is. But we're good. We, we hedged up Annihilator. We won't be able to salvage the Annihilator, sadly. Ah, no. 49 picks. We also headshot this guy. Can't pick that. Victor. I called him. Cyclops. No. Hunchback. Headshot as well. I can't take that guy. But I actually kind of want to take three LBXs. And somewhere down here, hopefully, there's three bins of ammo. Lovely. So we've got three LBXs out of it. That ain't too bad. And we get two PPCX oh, tier 5. 32, well, 33 damage per second. Rate of fire of 28 rounds per minute. That's insane. Medium rifle burst fire tier 5 and 8010 burst fire tier 5. That's good rewards. I like them. 
And no, I want to repair you. I don't. Do I want to take you into this next one? No, I don't think I do. I want to take the and the Atlas, I think. Or do we take the load? Uh, the load of kings, good. But is it is it good enough for where we're going? I don't think it is. I think I want the Atlas. I want the extra armor, basically. And Ooh. do I take? An 82 rate of fire to stick on the roughneck. Let's buy a couple of them. And yeah, this time we. So I'm scripting the tale that ends on Solaris. Nothing is going to stand in my way, well, except for these final teams in this free for all match. Honestly, they should just throw in the towel now and save us all some time. But nope. They're going to drag us through the motions, so let's not play with our food and vaporize these pretenders. Then punch our golden ticket on Solaris. The Duncan Fisher comeback tour is on. <laughs> right, so let's go for it. We're not getting much. We're getting 5 million sea bills. Damage coverage of 1 million, which is good. And yeah, I want to swap to the Atlas. Let us go. Why did it reset those? Interesting. Definitely didn't jump out that time and it's reset them. And Clearly something's going wrong go. there. This is a team free-for-all match to decide who will snag the opening team slot in the upcoming FedCom Unification Tournament. Being held on Solaris on New Year's Eve. Is this open? I think she means Red's the next day. chapter in my heroic journey back to Solaris. Oh, no, it Get was open. your head in the fight. We can't talk our way through this. Where there is a will and sharp wits, there is a way. Okay, I think it loaded some How mechs have you in. How stayed alive this long? I'm the hero of my own story. I can't die. Ugh, I'm getting too old for this shit. Oh, that's Teams a repair from the bay. Knights, ah. Exterminators and demon sharks look fierce. There's also the mudslingers to deal with. Mason and Fisher are facing stiff competition. I'm going to skirt. When we're through with them, they'll all be limp noodles strewn across the arena floor. Hey, head on a swivel. They're closing in from every direction. Whoa, Let's see mama, if there's any other repair like bays. Don't let them bite you in the ass. Fuck no. no. Ooh, that's a uh, king crab. Their offensive capabilities could be impacted after that strike. Let's see if that Design changes the complexion of the match. Target stalker. Oh well, let's go in, shall we? Target that acquired. is a Marauder two. So there is another potential to get a Marauder two in the base in the vanilla game now. I'm missing everything. Target, King Crab. Finally hit something. Their firepower just suffered a huge dent. Target destroyed. You've got to be kidding me. The exterminators have been ousted. She means exterminated. The exterminators entered this qualifying tournament as heavy favorites. Now this competition is wide open. We're headed for an exciting finish here. You can feel the intensity pulsing through the arena out there. But I'd like this. Powerful. Direct hit! Their firepower just took a hit. Got him. Come on. Ah, oh, can't get him anymore. Target acquired. Oh, it took their leg off. This okay, match that was be good. Come on. Go down. And the intensity is ramping you. up as only half the contestants remain. Not much. We're inching closer to finding out who will secure the gone. coveted open spot in the new year. 
Yum. Your legs. Keep your eye on the prize. This is our match to lose, pal. Stop. I'm in it to win it. Let's make the repair bay. Well, too late. And somehow, by some crazy turn of events, the mudslingers have been flung out of the match. Wait, can I get it before they happen? finish talking? The demon sharks are taken out. Unbelievable. It appears all the sharks were good for were coming to waters. I can't believe what I'm seeing here. The spawn knights are eliminated. They won't be respawning back into this competition. Can I, can I activate this before? Will I break the game? System offline. No, we're good. Right, so what are we waiting for? We've won, have we not? Apart from Round them talking. Round I'll two. Another chance for Duncan Fisher and Jake Mason to finally be taken out of the competition. Not that I'm no. really that or anything. Ah, there's an annihilator. Right. No, come, come back here. I don't want to engage this. Put a shot in. So don't want that enough. If I can help it, I'm going to take out as little as possible <laughs> to survive this. I'm just going to wait, basically. Purple Cobras. Are they from Team Marek? New target, Black Knight. Knights. Target acquired. Jaeger's halved. I'm actually going to come around this way. Let's come over here. Come over here, Duncan. Come over here. I know it's not very fan friendly, but so be it. This match is losing its momentum out there. These mech warriors seem to be wearing down. Let's hope they've still got some gas left in the tank. Target acquired. I'm pretty sure I could not take all these guys off properly. If I was just to go all in. stuck on the terrain, then I might take advantage of them. Oh, friendly fire, what's the Well, I've taken one out. Just hold here. Anyone that pops round has actually every team has lost one. Interesting. Energy levels are low. This match is turning into a low event battle. Someone needs to do something to kick it up a notch. There you go. The we kicked it up a notch. Cut down, which I didn't think was possible heading into this thing. Stop shooting me in the face. <laughs> oh dear. Right. Five more million sea bills. Ah, destroyed that PPCX. Never mind. There's a champ. There was a champion somewhere. There's an LBX tier four. There's also. Yeah. We're gonna say share cost three for tier four weapons. Are you kidding me? 
can take that. ER, large laser, short burst, a large pulse laser, ultra auto cannon. Okay, okay, there's some good weapons here. Anything you need? I don't need any more LBX ammo, I don't think. Double heat sinks, we'll take a couple more of those. And so we'll take some AMS ammo and some AC5 ammo, because we didn't got any of that apparently. Looking good. So we get a Highlander vest with a AC20 rate of fire or rapid fire, medium lasers, assault great sword, and an arena supercharger, and two SRM6s. Not a bad mech. Uh, heavy rifle, burst fire, and an arena supercharger tier 3. So, well, slap me with coolant canister and call it a victory. That was hardcore and intensely satisfying. The pressure of the moment was staring us in the face. And what did we do? Our auto cannon said we will not be denied. Boom. That's how legends are made. I didn't actually have any auto cannon. I know I did in the second one. Yeah, an AC-20. You, my friend, are clutch. No bum moves here. The, the, this bodes well for me. Finally taking Solaris by storm and claiming my rightful place amongst the great mech warriors who've graced the arenas. When all is said and done, mech fans will, be, will regard me like the legend killer Grey Newton. Justin Allard will be begging me for my autograph and asking for me for tips they might even end up renaming the arena after yours truly <laughs> but let's not forget you my trusty companion it wouldn't be a bit more tricky without you on my team as a token of my generosity i'm throwing in a sweet bonus to keep you on my side to help me rack up the wins and once we hit the nearest watering hole in solaris city the first drinks on me. Then, of course, I'll graciously let you buy a few rounds. <laughs> to recharge those systems, buddy, I need you in top shape for the tournament. We just have a small pit stop to make. A friend is hooking me up with a, a souped-up mech that'll allow me to showcase my skills and snag glory in the FedCom Unification Tournament. We're going to ring... In the new year in style. Awesome. Very good. Let us repair. I mean, I got a headshot quite bad, didn't I? So, I actually quite like this. But let's take a look at it. I want to keep an AC-20 on there. And I wouldn't mind keeping that one on there. But ultimately... We want a bigger, badder weapon. I think an LBX solid might be good. Supercharger. We'll ditch that. Double heat sinks, SRMs. Do we have a better SRM? Do we have two SRM Artemis, which we might well be able to put in here? We can. Do we have better medium lasers? We have one. We have a couple of short bursts, slightly better. And do I have a big axe of any kind? There's an assault greatsword, which is exactly what we got. Um, no, fine. Ammo, LBX, LBX, SRM Artemis, I only got one bit of that. Buy a few more bins then. I think one more heatsink is good. So it fits in perfectly there. Done. Want a bigger sword, but I think we will make do with that one for the moment. Well, a better quality sword. But yeah, let's uh, leave and depart and see where we end up. 166 days. I've got the money, so it's fine. And there's nothing here we want. Prepped and ready, Commander. No pilots we want. No, let's go.
downtown Solaris City. Moments ago, I caught up with Randall Logan, a member of the Inglorious Outcasts, the group suspected of commandeering the mech and setting it aflame. For years, the Solaris Games and others like it have offered great wealth and fame to countless victors. But they have also maimed or ended the lives of many others, all to the sound of cheers and applause. We call on those responsible. Blah, blah, blah. This sounds like boring nonsense. A big old nothing burger with extra cheese. Let's get down to business. Solaris, <laughs> the holy grail of mech duel. Yours truly finally makes a triumphant return to these legendary arenas. Citizens across Greyland and Equatus and the entire inner sphere will watch as I blow up. <laughs> Metaphorically, of course. Burning to death is not my idea of a good time. But obliterating other mech warriors that are fighting in the Solaris arenas? Haha! <laughs> Count me in! Buckle up, Solaris! Daddy's home! <laughs> and Daddy is home. But we're not there yet. Then we have to do a pit stop first. Did not say something about getting a shiny new mech. Well, let's, uh, I can't actually see where we are. There's some cantinas. I don't think it makes any difference on these. I mean, I could technically claim that, but I'm getting ammo. Game, you're giving me tier five weapons and mechs for f just stuff. And I'm getting, well, it's single heat sinks. This needs to change. I know there are mods to update these, but I haven't seen a mod that is good. Let's say there's some dodgy ones out there. Um, objectives, collect a Vulcan, collect an Irby, kill assassins. Mm, that one I think I can get rid of. I'm pretty sure I'm never going to get that one. But I'm thinking I could potentially be able to do that one right now. Yep, there we go. And, ooh, EW Active Probe. Pick up a couple of those. Anything else here? No, let's see, there's a regular supercharger. Aha, they do still exist. Well,. Got me a little bit extra. Actually, I don't get any money. I lose money. But I do get some of that done. And then I can do Collect a Javelin. And by any chance, Collect a Vulcan, Irby, and Javelin. Do I have any of those? Not in storage. No. Oh well, I tried. Let's see what else is here. There's a Gauss Rifle Tier 4. AC5 rate of fire. I'm going to pick up that. PPCX. Nope. It's not high enough tier. I've got tier 5 and 4. So. Ooh, heavy longsword. Assault knuckles. Assault claymore. Tier 2. No, I don't think that's worth it. Fine. And nothing there. I've seen it all. Now, I want to get paid for it. No decent pilots. So. Let's just go to mission briefing. Um, okay, right. So let's let's just jump into this. Hopefully, there's some talking. Heavy weather warning is in effect, Commander. Your visibility will be compromised out you know there. What? I want to try out the Highlander. Let's give that a try. I haven't tried out the Roughneck yet, but that's because I'm. Um, Okay, I need bigger mechs, now, I'd buddy. say. My contact is set to meet us at the marked sewage plant. That's a crappy place for a deal to go down, but I need my souped-up mech. Then I'll be ready to take Solaris by storm. Or should I say, shitstorm. <laughs> yeah. Right, I want to... Ah, 
that. Might be a bit of a weird setup, but we'll see how that works. Duncan Fisher is with me. There he is, with a double PPCX AC10 Warhammer. Do I get to keep that mech at some point? Game. That would be awesome. Actually. Still close that. Whoops. Over here. Tank just there. There we go. Jaeger. Anything. We got under his um, missiles. We've got this. Yeah, two more enemies somewhere. One. There is one of the more tanks. Destroy it. And there's the last one. Awesome. Ding. Done like dinner. Done like dinner. Fair enough. Right. Oh wait, no, we're going this way. Whoopsie. Walking away from where I need to be. I should see this bit when I was in here fighting the Jaeger, but because I was too busy fighting the Jaeger. Buying it, so to speak. That's what it feels like to me, should I say. That trees, because nobody loves trees. They are the most armored trees in the world because they will stop a Gauss rifle. Got more company. And they don't stand a chance against you. Hmm. You don't get it. We always collect. Target acquired. Target acquired. Target acquired. Where's the last two? Target oh, just there. Target well, there's one. Oh, yeah, the problem is too many trees, I can't see anything. I wish I had a UAV right about now. They don't exist in vanilla, do they? Yes, they do. I hope that Fisher would you know, go find them and I can just follow him, but apparently not. Aha, there we go. Right. Next. Jumps hit the road hard. You've made enemies with the wrong people. I make enemies with the right people. 
people too. So the joke's on you. I make enemies with the right people too. Well, that's one way of putting it. Alright, let's keep moving and get our hands on this mech. Copy that. So tell me, what's so special about this mech? Not a clue, but I've got a friend who tells me he's been playing with recovered helm core tech. The cutting edge of mech-ass kickery. So it tells me it's a rough deck. So it tells me it's the indomitable. Which is not... Then that's boring. Alright, we are uh, at the abandoned thing. I've just stepped with something explosive, but it just means there's an extra explosion in the video. Like those. And that one. Good. Stupid for showing your face here, Fisher. I'd say a solid mixture of both. So this is your friend, huh? In a manner of speaking. <laughs> you cost the Solaris arms a lot of sea bills. They paid you to showcase a mech. Instead, you show how to lose. Miserably. You need to pay up. I'll have the money once I win the tournament. But I need that mech to do it. That wasn't the deal. You want the mech? You've got to fight for it. swamp and saved your ass <clears throat> again hey my ass is very grateful <laughs> all right saving his ass seems to be what we're here for but that's fine that's not a problem let's see what mech he gets do we get to see here there's a ryan that we headshot but we can't take with us because we don't get the salvage for it yes um so might as well take that, might as well take that. Is there anything here that we need to take with us? No. Wow, we're getting... Yeah, a lot of junk. Just take some of that, fine. We get an extra 3 million sea bills and 10 more reputation. Well, Travis Shirk turned out to be a real piece of work. I mean... I didn't expect a red carpet, but I sure as hell didn't think they'd try to put a cap on us. You know, I'm usually real good at talking my way out of trouble, but this time, they weren't just pointing a gun at my head, they were firing at it. So let me fill you in on why I skipped town from Solaris in the first place. See, a while back, Solaris Arms sponsored yours truly to flaunt their fancy mechs and let me tell you the pressure was on but here's the kicker i had a rough patch of losses and the fans started whispering that i was throwing matches on purpose can you believe it they thought i was so good at being bad so i cooked up a plan to sharpen my skills making a grand comeback and win the hearts of solaris fans while clearing my debts i was sure that once i got my hands on my mech back on my mech it'd be smooth sailing but let me tell you the waters just got a whole lot choppier that souped up mech we just grabbed turns out to be rigged with not with a nasty kill switch travis gets the last laugh this time my trusty old rust bucket is too banged up for a quick fix leaving me high and dry with nothing to roll into the tournament with 
but my my skin and bones and sharp tongue and even i know i can't use my words as ammo out there so mason looks like you're gonna have to brave the arena without old duncan fisher by your side think you can handle the next heat without my flair it ain't gonna be a walk in the park but i know you got the skills as for me i'll be waiting for my next tournament to swing around so i can strut my stuff in the meantime, I'll be in your corner cheering you on and offering my unbeatable expertise and colourful insights as you blast your way to championship glory. So we got to do this all by ourselves now. Well, we'll find out in the next video. So thank you all for watching. It's been interesting. Yeah, we don't actually get to see what um, mech he was going to run yet i'm thinking it'll make an appearance potentially um but yeah that's it for this video so thank you all for watching i hope you enjoyed it if you did hit that like button hit that subscribe button and i'll see you next time for some more dueling action